morning I believe it is it's probably like noon honestly I finally decided to pick up the camera because I am feeling a little bit better plus um, David and I have decided to take a chill day and be home with Nala and spend time with her there has been a a handful of changes I have spoke about on a couple of my live streams but you probably only seen one because I only kept one uploaded but in Nala's room I had took out her crib and put it in our room because her room in here has very poor ventilation we did buy a humidifier and a pur purifier and it's still really stuffy. I noticed that when we're both in here sleeping, we both get sick. So we had moved our her pack and play out of our room and put it in her room. So uh, we was going to just pack it down, put it somewhere else. But it was like, why? Well, just put it in here for now. So that is what it's looking like. I love this little crib um, fitted sheet thing that we got from, um, where did we buy this from? Maybe Target? I don't really know. But it's really cute. It's not too girly. But I love that. So we just put that in here. Today we are probably going to be doing a little bit of riding around. And doing looking at some models. Because we only uh, expect to stay in this house probably two or three more years. That's right, babe. That's the plan. That's the plan. That's the hopes. If Jesus let us. Watch this. It's so dark in here. I got it. It's some light. Uh, you need to turn on. But watch this. Come on. Hold on one second. Hold this. I'm going to turn on the light. That didn't work. Oh. <laughs> okay, that worked. Watch this. You guys. <laughs> 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 Is that funny to you? Is that funny to you? <laughs> you usually hate your face being white. Yeah, she likes it. Oh, that's what I went in the room for, to find her gum thing. Her. Oh, yes. We got to start paying more attention to her gums and teeth now that she has two little teethuses in her mouth. So we're gonna use um, the little wipes until I guess we go decide to buy her a toothbrush and whatnot. And if you haven't seen it before, it's these little things like this by Dr. Brown's. It's tooth and gum wipes. So we're gonna use this to clean her teeth. I don't even think David has even used this before, have you? No. Yeah. But these could be pretty handy. Look at thick little legs. Thick little legs. She has gotten so long. Open up. And chubby now. Her face Open so up. round now. Open up. Open up. Open up. Don't be too rough. Open up. Stop biting it. <laughs> she might as find this flavor. Try to clean off the teeth, her gums, her cheeks. <laughs> ow. 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 Yeah, he don't know Stop. what I be dealing with. Stop. Stop. Let it go. Let it go. Alright, open up. <laughs> Trying to eat it. <laughs> no. No. Did you get cheeks? Yeah, I got that early. Can we do a cross check? Can we do a cross check? Let's clean those teeth. This is clean the front. Clean the front. Now you want to huh. open up your mouth for your mama. You want to open it up your mouth for me. Clean out the front. Clean out the bottom. Under your tongue. Uh-huh. Under the tongue. On the, on the teeth. And over here, <laughs> where the cheeks at? Over here, where the cheeky cheeks? The back, right under here. That tongue, that tongue, 
that time. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And then clean this cheek. And on the top. <laughs> Stack right here. And back there. Good job. You did a good job. But while he changes a diaper, I can show you what it looks like, the space looks like now in our room because clearly because her crib is in our room now, our night routine has changed dramatically because I am finally sleeping back in my room, which feels good. So this is what the space is looking like. Our room is really big. And that's one thing I really like about the house is that the room is really big so it doesn't really feel cluttered that this gigantic crib is actually in our room if you remember seeing her room it was it made the room feel quite small but everything fits a little bit better in here so the routine that I got going on now is uh, we took the Dakota out her crib because she started to roll so it wasn't safe for her to be in there so took it out um, and now uh, she really likes plush covers and things like that so I had tucked these under the mattress so that she won't really realize that she's actually in her crib so when I transition her this is what I do at night she loves this new blanket set that we got we got this from home goods or whatever but it's really heavy white cover I never thought I would ever have a white comforter set but I do but she really likes this so I usually feed her in the bed and she likes to stretch out in here and sometimes she has to watch her little cartoon shows right now she's into Puss in Boots so we'll sit here on my phone while the sound machine is on and she'll usually fall asleep in the bed and I let it sit there for a while and then I transition her to the crib and usually as long as I kind of put her slightly on her side and lay her on this, she'll fall asleep fast. I notice if I don't have something plushy like this or her blanket on the crib, she doesn't fall asleep as fast. I tried looking for um, fitted sheets that were kind of this material, but the ones that I found were really hot. And I didn't really want it to make her hot, especially since right now i don't really have a a sleep set for her i really need to get one because as you know it's not really safe for them to use blankets so by her laying out on this it kind of helps her but we are really planning on getting her a sleep set so we're gonna go to once upon a child today to go find one for the low low and yeah so that is the little routine now and now she sleeps pretty good but we need to learn how to have the same type of routine when we are not home that's the only problem because she is going through a transition that she is kind of struggling with her schedule generally the rule of thumb is she usually sleeps around 8 to like 5 30 now or she go to bed maybe more like 9 so what I generally do now to save my life because y'all know I don't do well with waking up too much I am not a morning person so what I do is on my little rocker ottoman I might think I'm crazy but this is what it works for me let me move my nose for you to always gotta have that close but I keep wipes and a stack of diapers on this ottoman uh, for quick changes in the middle of the night then on my nightstand I'll have the formula I'm using right now I'm using Infamil Gentle Ease so I will have Usually two bottles filled with only water. Just depends if I need more if in the daytime and I don't really feel like getting out of bed too much. I would have the water bottle and I would just literally when I start to hear her cry, I would just put my scoops in the bottles and then shake them and just give them to her. So that is a lot easier in routine when it comes to breastfeeding or pumping i should have to get up in the middle of the night or early morning pump and then give it to her or it was just always a lot this is so simple it's right there i shake and go but if you don't already know this i stopped breastfeeding and pumping all together i haven't pumped 
in like a week and a half. In the last two weeks, I pumped maybe three times. I do plan on pumping one last time because I feel like there's a little knot right here. So I feel like it's milk. So I might end up pumping today, later. So we're gonna go to the store, uh, go to Once Upon a Child, find a sleep sack and then probably do a little bit of house shopping. Yeah, we end up going to Once Upon a Child actually the other day on my dad's birthday because we end up buying this little like extra saucer thing right here. And she likes it pretty decently, but I feel like I feel like when she first got it, she absolutely loved it. Now she notices that we're trying to put her in it and put her down and not hold her. And I don't think she feels that. I don't think she likes that. So now she's just being bougie. And when we were at your dad's house when we first used it. So now that she's here, she knows all the other stuff that she has here. Yeah, so she kind of wants to be in like other things or she want to be held or whatever. You just being mm, just picky for no reason. Being picky. Yeah, so I feel like when we home, maybe I can get 10, 15 minutes out of it. But when she was at my dad's house, she was in there like 40 minutes. Mm -hmm. I don't know, but we need to save our arms. <laughs> yeah, she's getting heavy. She is heavy. She is not light. So we try to find something that works. But the only thing we can always count on is one, the swing, and two, um, car rides. Oh, what's that? This is a uh, two, uh, well, 35. So, this is the front. Got lighting and stuff like that. The hair and bone pattern. And then this is the foam one diner. I wouldn't have thought to do the blue like that, but that's nice. Oh, that's a really dark blue. Yeah, it looks good. I like this table. It's actually, yeah. it's big. Got enough table. Got enough chairs, but mm -hmm. I like that. <laughs> and this is the no, wet bar. Butler's pantry. Okay, no, this is nice, great. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's nice. Big cabinets, both two inches cabinets. Yeah, big pantry. Oh yeah, that's huge. Yeah. I like the tile all the time. It's like our tile. I just like that it's tile. Mm -hmm. and not Got the two mirrors here. And then you have the kitchen. I like it. I like the kitchen. Yeah, this is beautiful. Cause it has. I still like that it's facing. The living room, the sink area. Yeah, under not sink. Another, another big table. Another table. Another big table. And a good size living room. Mm -hmm. There's a, there's a big one. Yeah, I like this. Do we know how big this house is? Thirty-seven. Oh, okay. She doing the same thing I'm doing. Um, and then a little patio on the back. Nice. Cute. This is good entertaining. Mm -hmm. Like, you know. That's a big TV too. Yeah. That gotta be like a 75. Yeah. And then this is a bedroom. Oh. Oh, I thought I was tripping. I was like, why well, I heard talking? Uh-oh. Is, is this the master? Yeah, this is the master. So the master's downstairs. Got a tray ceiling in here? Tray ceilings. This is definitely a king. A pet, a uh, must-have for me is a tub in a shower so this yeah. is good but it got a butt opening space <laughs> Sit down right there. so that will be yours this will be mine I'm good with this one. look at this big old closet that's huge big old closet but it's... Uh, and then 
Cool. We gotta put some pictures in our bathroom like this. Yeah. In our toilet room. Yeah. <laughs> mm hmm That's a nice dresser. Yeah, I gotta get out of here, copyright. And then store oh this where laundry would be yeah. this is a random place so far i've seen oh yeah the office no a good place to edit yeah. and then see good size powder room see i don't I don't like the mess of being separated like that. Yeah. All right, I'm getting on. Ooh, look at that. I'm painting. He got two AC units. Ooh, sound like a big bill. Yeah. <laughs> hey, it's huge up here. So this is like the game bonus room. This is yeah, it is hot up here though. Yeah. I think this is, this is what auntie trying to do with the popcorn, with the, with the theater. Gotta take a break, a little tired. Oh yeah. <laughs> I wanna try this chair over here. Hate time. Them chairs are pretty cool. They're beautiful actually. This is a big space. This is definitely like the party area. You need a like a little like little wet bar in out here. Use for storage. Store a walk-in water unit. unit. Walk-in AC unit. Why? Why would they waste that much space in there? Okay, let's turn to your right. Here's a another bathroom. But what is this? Ooh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Scared the little daylight out of me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. in there. Oh. <laughs> There's a bathroom. This is pretty good. Big bathroom. Pretty good. Separated, so it's good for older kids. Yeah, these rooms are big, way bigger than our rooms. Yeah, and these are big closets. Uh, life jacket. <laughs> this first gonna be a life jacket. Like that. <laughs> and four bathrooms. Another big bathroom. What a tub. Did that one have a shower in it? Yeah. The other one? Yeah. They're like right next to each other though. I know. <laughs> this is definitely meant for an older family. <laughs> so this is four bathrooms. It's a big bedroom, huh? And this is so cute. No, this could be your room. So we seen one, two, three, four bedrooms and four bathrooms. Yes. Okay. Let's no. Yeah. yeah, four bathrooms and three and a half bathrooms. The first bathroom's a half bathroom. A bathroom's a bathroom. You ain't got no tub and shower. That's fine, but it's a bathroom. Another laundry room. Laundry. So you got one downstairs and upstairs. Huh. Okay. And five. Dang, these bedrooms are big. Cause I kind of remember now why I said, said no to this you said one. That was too much space or something. Like that. No, I think it was kind of unnecessary with all the bathrooms and kind of like it was made for like a huge family. But it's five bedrooms. And then I said um, the the master being downstairs. Yeah. I mean, it's still a nice house. Boy, that this man scared the living there that sent me. And he ain't, he ain't even make his uh, his parents known or anything. Really? He was just chilling. Do you look like he worked here? Huh? Do you look like he worked here? 
Yeah, he was too comfortable not to work here. Mm -mm. Can't have it. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Don't try. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Made a little spit pit stop the Wendy's and now the first time you really see Nala have an interest in food. Mm -hmm. Yeah, get in, get out. Get in, get out. <laughs> watch it watch watch the way she let me. When you eat a fry, hello. See. Nala. She looking at the burger. Nala. I don't, I don't care about the fry. <laughs> She like that burger. Look at her. Gotta get in, get out. She about to get you. She about to get you. She she got you a little bit. Yeah, get in, get out. She try to eat the paper. Yeah. Let it go. You can't have that. Can't have it. Can't have it. Oh, that got bacon in it too? Mm hmm. No, oh, I would have got that. Actually, I think I ate your burger. Because I don't see two meats in it. And you gonna really eat it, eat it. I, I ain't noticed it until I just looked at it. Until I said that? I ain't know. Because yours had the two different sauces in it, so I thought they put your burger in there. You done took giant, several giant bites out of my burger. You want the rest? You done ate the burger! It's still a little bit left. Try the other one, see if you like it. You make me sick. <laughs> he didn't enjoy my burger. He, he, you know what? He never noticed it until I said something. <laughs> he was just enjoying it. I was focusing on the baby. And then it got onions on it. It ain't got no lettuce on it. Uh, I thought it did. Look at this dry burger. If y'all don't know, I don't really do burgers like that, but the only burger I do like is the dream bacon from this place, but. It's like a burger, burger. You'll eat half of it and then the rest of it. And then you have that I don't thing. know because you tackled my sandwich. What? Well, this burger's nasty. Give it to me. Guess I have to eat it now. I wonder if uh, Nala's going to be a picky eater. Hmm. I don't think so. Mm -hmm. Oh damn. You got some napkins. Why are you contaminating everything of mine? It's in the way. What do you mean? It been there the whole time. It's in the way. I was trying to put my trash over there. What are you putting your trash over here for? Because there's some more space. Like, he done put his elbow in my sauce. He like contaminate everything of mine. Let me have my stuff. He ain't that much love and marriage in the world. I don't got no cooties. She lies. You had a baby from me. So? <laughs> I wasn't gonna stop their cooties? Yep. No. Here go a couple of them. Wait a minute. I'm over here dropping stuff. Those look like they're pretty easy to put her in at night. 
Yeah, just meant to be blankets. Nice. Here's a uh, giraffes. This the wraps. Some of them are just like this. You just zip them in. Uh huh. Here's a little baby one. This look like Lion King or something. Mm-hmm. It's a different material. It's soft. It's like a blanket. Mm. Four bucks. So this one has like a swaddle made inside of it. I'm sorry, if you don't want to use it, you'll just un... Let me see. Oh, I guess you can swaddle them or leave their hands out. Hands to face or just hands out. I think you should get that. We should get this one. It's just oh, like kind of the best of both worlds. Yeah. For those times we do want to swaddle. Mm. It's a Halo one. Name brand. Let's see what else they have. This is where I usually get. Um, The diapers. Yeah. And they have a diaper bag. Fourteen dollars. That's like what forty dollars at Target or something. Mm, nah, it's actually twenty five dollars. Oh, okay. It's cold in here, ain't it, Nala? Cold. Cold. Time to go. Time to go. Time to go. Time to go. <laughs>